<laughs> that was in the hot tub. Right there. And it could be because I was in the hot tub, but I think the temperature dropped like 15 degrees while I was in there. It definitely could be just because I was in the hot tub. But, uh, there was another couple in the hot tub over there, but otherwise, it was still empty. I was in the hot tub for like half an hour. <laughs> if you can see up here above the TV screen, I don't know if you can see it, but there's like a little wind. It's a whipping. It's going so fast. That wind picked up. And I did not want to get out of the hot tub at all. I figured we're going north. It's just going to get colder and colder at this point. So I'm going to leave the spice lounge. Look, it looks so tropical on that screen. And I'm going to walk around a little bit more and, and keep taking videos. Okay, hold on. Okay, so this is inside the 16th floor where the Spice Lounge is, Margaritaville is, uh, the Teen Entourage Club. There's a pretty cool, uh, there's a pretty cool arcade up here. This is also where the jogging track is. There's a couple people jogging, but look at this arcade here. <clears throat> So, I mean, if I were a kid, this is where I would probably be most of the time. And once again, there's no one in here. It's it's 8 o'clock. You're on vacation, I get it. So what, you stay up till 2 a.m.? Doesn't make sense. Doesn't make sense. So I'm going up to... This is 17. So this is uh, this, like the sports complex. And mini golf and the ropes course and up here is the basketball court where there's no one right now so if I want to play a little game of one on zero I got it you watching the shot you watching the shot damn it okay on the other side of the basketball court is the ropes course but you get up there, they tether you to the ceiling so you can't fall in the ocean, but there's all these different steps and uh, stuff like that, and then you've got the rock climbing wall there. So this stuff opens at like 11, and there's instantly a mile long line. So it's pretty difficult. <laughs> you gotta get in line here. You gotta wait and wait and wait, and I just don't like sitting and, sitting and waiting, you know? Oh, hold on. Okay, so before we leave the back of 16, this is Margaritaville. So it's like a restaurant. You're inside, but you're outside. And there's this buffet. It's all you can eat. So they have breakfast, they have lunch, they have dinner. This is one of our favorite spots. For whatever reason, a lot of people don't come up to 16. Uh, hold on. So right now, this is the jogging track to get up here. I got up here a total of three times so far. I uh, did three miles. So each lap around this jogging track uh, is an eighth, an eighth of a mile. So it takes eight laps around the track to do a mile. So you figure 24 laps to do three miles. <clears throat> and of course I forgot my Fitbit so that didn't work out. Yeah, rows and rows of seats on 16. So for laying out and uh, a couple days they were packed and uh, you got the hot tub and one of the pools over there is a total of six hot tubs and two pools and a kiddie pool and five water slides on this it's, a, it's insane so now I'm gonna bring it up to the the front of uh, the ship this is the other side of 17 so this is the front of the ship uh, and there's awesome little wicker beds where you can lay out. Bigger ones over here. These are like queen size wicker beds. So if you want to really fall asleep with your loved one, you can sit up here and just get burnt, you know? And uh, out here we can look at where we're going. And that is the front of the ship. So that's heading north to New York City on this side. To the, to the left side is where the land is, <clears throat> but we're pretty far out there still. Right now, I'm on the highest sun deck there is. 
So typically there's chairs all out, but we can see one of the pools there and there's some guy doing laps right there, that's pretty cool. And then there's the water slides, and we're walking down there a little bit earlier. Uh, so this is the highest sun deck you can be on. And it's incredible up here when you're in the Bahamas and you can see all the blue water and see, you know, the beaches and all that stuff. There is a spot where you can pay an extra membership fee. It's called, I think, at the Beach Club or something like that. So this is, we can spy on that right there. So they got uh, special chairs and special pads and their own bar and two other hot tubs. I didn't even know that. So there's actually a total of eight hot tubs on here. And that's the spa, the spa section where you gotta pay an extra, two, I think it's 250 bucks to get in that area. But uh, I'm happy with the free stuff. Now I'm down on 15. So this is where the band plays. This is where the four hot tubs are for the main section and the hot tub and the waiting pool. And it's still early, so there's not a lot of people out here. But uh, I wouldn't be able to do this if this was packed. And this is spring break, so it usually is packed. But just because it's 8 o'clock, no one gets up at 8 o'clock. Okay, mimosa. Breakfast drink. Breakfast of champions, I would say. It's, a, it's mostly champagne with a little tiny bit of orange juice, just enough to make it yellow. And uh, champagne, it's warm. Wakes you up, makes you forget how windy and cold this is right now. We got the child section, child pool, all that stuff. So we're on 15, and we just basically went from the front of the ship to the back of the ship. So this is sorry, buddy. Garden Cafe. So all you can eat breakfast. Awesome, 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 awesome ice cream if you want it. And we got uh, milk and lots of meats. Oh, lots of stuff. Hello. Everybody is so friendly. I'm gonna get off of here because there's so many people around. I don't want to be weird. I try to take the stairs everywhere I go. So there's a total of. 16 floors that you can take the elevator for. I try to take the stairs for all of them. Um, so, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9. They're all basically uh, floors for the suites, for the balcony suites. So those floors you kind of just burn right through. Okay, so we got down past 9. Now this is 8. This is the start of the restaurants and the shops and all that stuff. So we got <clears throat> steakhouse there. Here's the elevators if I would have taken them. That's just, this is floor eight. So um, we're down on Trade Winds, which is the duty free shop. Looks like most of it's closed. So they got jewelry and smokes and alcohol and. Now uh, you can get the pictures, so there's professional photographers walking around the ship all the time. And then they upload them to your room number and you can buy them, you can get a package or whatever, but it's $25 per print. And then they have packages where if you get uh, 10 pictures, it's $150, so it brings it down to 15 per print, but I mean, it's just insanity. I have a, I have a Super HD camera here. I'm a, I'm a professional photographer myself. So there's bars everywhere, and right here is the uh, giant chandelier, it changes colors, right now they have it going white, and then it's pretty cool, they got an ice bar, as if you're in New York City, so it's like the Shvedka ice bar, um, they got sushi over there, it, it's, this, it is incredible, it's, uh, it's super incredible. So this is one of the restaurants. They have a smoking lounge over here that is super cool. And we can go outside. So there's coffee there. And there's this deck. I mean, there's endless things to do. So we just walk through the eighth 
floor. So there's the front of the ship, and then there's the aft, A-F-T. And as Jessica would like to say, aft, 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 aft. So this is uh, floor seven. So this is the Irish restaurant bar. <clears throat> you can see down into the atrium. So when there's stuff going on down there, you can see it. Uh, there's a nice restaurant. They do breakfast stuff. They have a bar. It's nice. Then you get into the casino where there's uh, there's the slots and they're smoking. So it smells like smoke a lot. Uh, whenever we go through here, we kind of run without breathing. But there's poker. There's craps. There's little arcade games that will give you thousands of dollars. It's pretty wild. We are at the other end of seven. So this is the aft. And the way you know this shit. So right here, seven, aft. So that's the back. That's the back of the boat. And right now they got this uh, fire door closed, but this is the Manhattan room. That's where we had our anniversary dinner. And that is also our emergency station. So if the ship starts going down, it's rowing. We're down on six at the aft. So uh, this is where we have two restaurants. Uh, they're basically identical. One is called Savor, which is over there. And the other one is called Taste, which is over there. And they're basically the same exact thing, uh, just with a different name. We had, we had dinner at both. Awesome. It was great. Uh, then we have all the art. So they have art auctions on the boat. And that one was pretty good, huh? Yeah. With little doggies in the clouds. That's nice. So then, uh, I mean, the cheapest work art, I think, is $14,000 or something like that. So you got to be crazy to buy. I don't know. Today is the big art auction day. And... Right now I'm standing under that chandelier, and there are stairs to go up to those other floors. Uh, so that's kind of like the middle of six, seven, and eight. And then we are getting to the atrium now. So here is the atrium. They have like game shows here. People participate. So um, some people from work were doing a game show. It was like the best couple, and the cruise ship director definitely embarrass them, it was funny. Um, and then we have a coffee shop, which is not included in the package, but I'm probably gonna stop and get Jessica a coffee right now, because then she'll love me. Before I put the top on it, you guys gotta see. Ooh. Professionals at Lavazza over here. <laughs> I don't know what she's saying. Uh, I gotta put the top on this coffee the whole time. Back to it. So we're at the atrium where the game shows go on. Um, then guest services is over here. So if you want to book any excursions or uh, anything that's going on. And we're at six forward. Um, now down in five, that's like the rooms that aren't balconies. So they have the interior rooms and rooms without windows and stuff like that. Uh, they do have like, like fun house mirrors, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. So here they have all the officers and Dan Dan's there and the captain's there. And Kelly the shopping lady so some of these people we've met um, I mean the whole crew is incredible they are very friendly and they're running around and helping everybody out so I brought you back to six I don't know seven seven for a second uh, up where the, the Irish bar is but this is where the breakaway theater is so when we saw the magic show and rock of ages and burn the floor that was in that breakaway theater. So that's pretty cool. Now I'm just gonna book it up the stairs to get back to 10. Okay, this went from seven to 10. <clears throat> so we're on 10. These are all balcony rooms here. 
This is the interior of the ship, so it's just a wall. But because we were in the front, our room is in the back, in the aft. So now it's kind of a long walk to get past all these these rooms. We're 10304. Right now we're on 10214. So it's a little, a little bit farther. Back in the aft, we are at 10290. Couple more. 10304. Use your freestyle card. Oh, Jessica's awake. I'm making a movie, baby. So this is our room. Hi, Jesse. So they're fairly decent sized rooms. We got to the Lavaza. There's a nice TV. And we have the balcony here. So we're on the 10th floor. So there's nine below us. And then there's 11, 12, 13, and 14 above us. We got some friends down there and some friends down there, mostly work people. Uh, but I think this is where my movie ends.